I don't want to go to the ranch. What? I want to go to Disneyland. <gasps> Wait, really? Wait, what? Here we go. Here we go. Been going to these shows and it's been so much fun. My stomach doesn't really feel good. I don't know why. Are you good to shiver too? Nah. Cool. We just got here. Okay, is everyone in? Yeah. All right, since you guys did so good at cleaning up at the ranch, Dad has something he wants to tell you. What? I don't want to go to the ranch. What? I want to go to Disneyland. <gasps> Wait, really? Wait, what? Actually, guys, actually? Do you want to go to Disneyland? Yes. Yeah. You yeah, do? Go. Okay, uh -huh. let's yes. go. Okay, that's, that's why we woke okay. up so early. Lizzie has proof like... of this. I was sitting in our room, I was like, this is kind of weird, like the thing that we're doing. I was like, I have a suspicion that we're not going to the ranch. <laughs> and I was like, about that till then. This oh. is like we're going to Disneyland I and we're going to that. Disney. Yeah, I was like, oh, Ali's gonna be jealous. Why are we yeah. so jealous? She knows. Oh, she does? She knows. That's why you packed our clothes. Because I was like, Mom would not pack our clothes. She yeah, that, that clothes. was weird for me. I was like, whoa, Mom packed our clothes? Very sneaky. And she's not very sneaky and not very good of a liar. I'm not a good liar. <laughs> why would we not take the dogs to the ranch? <laughs> I don't know. Why not, actually, why not, actually, why not just was, say, let's take the dogs to the ranch? And no, that was like, a pretty good point because they're all worn that out. That was a good point because they're really worn out. I didn't See, think so. they, did, I did they thought it was so. good. I actually was like, we're not bringing the dogs Okay, well, let's go. Right? We're wasting let's time. Let's go, okay. go, go. go. It's fall break for the kids starting in two days. As in Canyon, we were able to get all their schoolwork done and Savannah and Lizzie have like live classes that they have to be part of. And so we're, Lizzie's right there already in her class. I'm trying to get the computer set up so Savannah can get into her class. It's so nice and like cars nowadays, there's a plug in here so we can plug in the computers. They can hook to the Wi-Fi on our phones and get all their work done while they're sitting in the car instead of just playing games on their phones the whole time. Those have to be replanted. If they can't be replanted, then someone has to replace them. So, the, hey, those are three thousand dollar trees. The cement guy showed up today when he was supposed to be there last week and tore out our olive trees that were supposed to be replanted. And Johnny is not happy about it. That's a six thousand dollar mistake by not communicating with me. Six thousand dollars. The trees are dead. They're done. And he knew it. You said that that you were gonna get some somebody to help you, you know, do this the right way. And I said, well, then why did you touch them? And why did you call me and say, hey, I'm ready to take these trees out? He's like, well, because then, because you said that, you know, you told me Friday, yeah, go ahead and, and, and make it happen. I said, you just told me what we talked about. Like you just, anyway, people just do what they want. Yeah. But whatever happened to, I'm paying you and. You do what I need you to do. And we can't get a hold of the landscaper. Oh, he called during the oh, he I did? Call him. Oh, okay. Okay. What did the landscaper say? He said he's gonna run by and check it. It doesn't sound good at all. And he said he's gonna run by and check and see if there's any way to save them. I mean, they're just trees, right? But it's the, it's less about the trees. It's the fact that he didn't. He didn't follow oh, direction. Yeah. I, you know, he just, the, the plan. What about the plan, you know? Right? The bathroom. Always. Yeah, the bathroom. Always. <laughs> Every time. Okay, let's go. Okay. Second Where ride. Second ride. Is I know. Pirates. Here we go. We've 
never been over to that island before. Yep, we've never been to Tom Sawyer's Island. Well, I have, but everyone other than me has not been to Tom Sawyer's Island before. We're going in the Dead Man's Grotto. Beware, Captain Lou Jack. This island is turned into more of like Pirates of the Caribbean themed. Yeah, it's cool. And it's really, really fun to be here with the little kids since they've been obsessing over Pirates of the Caribbean lately. So Lizzie was joking, not, not joking, she was serious about it. And we joked with her and said, this is Tom Sawyer's island. This has nothing to do with, with uh, Pirates of the Caribbean at all. And it's full on pirates. It is. Ah! <laughs> Get wet. Okay, I did not know that there were this many caves and little crevices and little places to play. We could have been here for hours, Sarah. We're back Driving here again. London. He's not paying attention. This is my friend Dylan. I didn't didn't introduce you last time we vlogged, but Dylan has been taking me to these shows for the last month, right? Yep. Count of Monte Cristo. This time it's School of School Rock. School of Rock, and then we're seeing Count again tomorrow. And, Beauty and then and the we're Beast. seeing Beauty and the Beast and Thriller. We've been going to these shows, and it's been so much fun because we're both theater geeks and nerds. Major. And major we turn into geeks. children when it comes to the horses of the set and the lighting and the sound and the <laughs> acting and the everything. So yeah. we're here again. We got back from Disneyland earlier today, so we decided that we're gonna watch before going to bed, so we're watching Casper, Friendly Ghost. So that's like the only thing we could find, really. So we're watching Casper, because it's so close to Halloween and stuff. Some other buddy? My stomach doesn't really feel good. I don't know why. Like you're gonna throw up not feeling good, or just? I can't tell. I just keep getting the feeling that I'm gonna throw up. You're shaking, buddy. I'll get you water bottle, okay? When I no. breathe out, but it just feels like that. But it feels good when I breathe in. That's it, keep deep breaths. I'm getting you more water. Mm, poor guy. Not cool, we just got here. Do you think it's something you ate? Are you good to shiver too? Are you cold? Um, I don't think it's cold because I'm not really cold. Just got the shivers? Yeah. You're talking to me in the mirror. Okay, well, I hope that maybe you ate too much candy. Dang it, I hope he's not actually sick. I don't think he is, Sarah. I think he's just, something's wrong with the, with the TV. Okay, so, um, <laughs> Sarah has been doing these uh, oils, essential oils for many years now. And we just, we just met the owners of uh, doTERRA, the ones that created the company. And um, we were having this conversation about the reason why we use the oils. Well, I just gave as three drops. Well, I was, I was trying for three drops of peppermint oil. This stuff right here, Savannah's gonna try it now too. Mm -hmm. This peppermint oil right here. I mean, that was very spicy, and I hate spicy, but my stomach feels so much better. L like how fast? That was like a minute like, ago. No, it was, yeah, a few seconds. Wow. Yeah. Oh. It's done? You're good? Yeah, I'm good. You got a smile on your face. How are you doing? You got a light awesome. under here too? You do have a light. How cool is that? Oh, it's bright. Um, okay, how you feeling? Great. I just still have the shiver and a... Oh, you still have the shivers? Yeah. And a teeny, teeny, tiny stomach ache. Just a teeny one though. Oh, okay. How about you, Kino, Masha? Tired? Oh, okay. All right, buddy. Good night. Love you. Love you. Good night, Kino Maja. Good night. Sleep good, Kay? Kay. Good night. Sleep good. Good night. Let the bed bugs bite. Ah. Hey, Kino. Hey, Giko. What? Good night. Good night. <laughs> Nine plus one. <laughs> plus four. Fourteen. Plus two. Sixteen. Sarah went through Lizzie's 
uh, schoolwork and found that she had some grades that were not where they need to be. So they're working through some of the the uh, math issues as loves math. As loves math, right? Like loves it. Canyon likes it. He likes science more. Lizzie hates math and hates science. Everybody's different. But anyway, this is uh, what's going on. I don't know how many hours we're going to be doing this, but they're trying to bring those grades up. And that's the cool thing about homeschool as well is we can adjust. We can work on the things that need to be worked on like right now instead of waiting until the next day. So I just did um, a lot of schoolwork to raise my grades. I got my F in math up to a C. I love you guys so much as always. You are worth it. Bye guys. Hey, bye!